Hello, hello. I'm really hoping that my audio is working this time. Unknown. We'll see. Um, but hi, if you're watching the replay, I'm just enjoying some coffee. Trying to get some energy going. Living the dream here. It's been an okay morning. I just made this, so it's like very full and uh, quite warm. Oh, um, I want to log in to one of these um, streams on my computer to see if it actually has any sound this time. Uh, so let me on this time. Yes, it does. Well, at least on Twitch. Let me double check. So Weeter. Yes, it does. Um. Oh my goodness. If it actually has any sound this time. And it's working on tweeters. So we love that. Uh, we love when technology works. It's like it's like it's helpful or something, you know. Um, I I thought I would just oh oh did I just oh I don't know what I just did. Um, we've got yeah I don't know why it's going away. <laughs> um, we've got Philip in the corner there, living his best life. I'm watching that other dog. Their name is Luna, but she's like a ghost. She just kind of like hides and will randomly like pop her head out. She would spend the entire day in her kennel, but I've, I've closed it so that she is kind of forced to explore a little bit more, you know, whatever. But she's in the living room on a pile of blankets with like her hands on her face and it's really cute. I'll try to get a video of it and post it to Twitter and or Instagram later, but she like randomly throughout the day like flips her hair back and it's very cute. She just, I thought she was like getting rid of an imaginary bug, but my friend that also watches this dog was like, has she flipped her hair yet? And then, like, right as that happened, she did it. And um, it was adorable. She just kind of walks around and, like, flips her hair. So, you know. Adorbs. Adorbs. If anyone wants to just, like, put something in the chat, just so I... If I can see it. I'd love to see if the Twitter's is working on this chat. Who knows? Technology. It's so fun. Uh, do I like this headset? No. Does my microphone want to connect? No, but I do have a lot of other audio slash microphone equipment. It's just in storage in like the valley. So, I mean, I kind of live in the valley, but it's like the valley. Oh. So this is my office. Um, after I got fired I kind of um I got fired in like May but it was a bit traumatic I was working in sales which honestly I'm great at but the company was just like going through a moment um I kind of just like closed off this room and was just like hoarding laundry in it because you know out of sight out of mind and uh and now I would like to utilize this space. I kind of have the idea of like turning the floor into just like a cuddle room. 
like I've got a bunch of like fur rugs from events and I have a bunch of fur pillows. Also I have boxes because I like I when I moved here three years ago, I moved in a day. So I I didn't really know that I was moving, but my roommates decided at the last minute to say that I couldn't prorate rent and move out on like the fifteenth that I had to move out, you know, like on the first. And I was just like like or pay for the entire month. Oh, oh, we've frozen. What's happened? We good? Hello? Hello? Okay. Well, something happened. I'm not sure what, but, um, whatever. Uh, I don't remember where I was in that sentence. So I'll just go back. They decided <laughs> that I needed to leave, you know, like on the first or pay for the entire month, that it was not an option to prorate the rent. And so I was like, okay, fine. I'll leave by the first. F you. Uh, and so I did. My friend Ellie came over and, uh, we packed up my entire life, you know, in all of the boxes. And when I moved here, I really didn't know where, like, anything was because, like, I didn't even pack most of it. And, like, I didn't have any time to, like, clean before I packed. So I packed a lot of things that I, like, didn't need. Um, so I spent some time this week emptying said boxes and you know, condensing five boxes into, like, one plastic tub. So that's lovely. The other use of this room is, uh, you know, I have a lot of paintings or a lot of canvases. So I, I'm making room for them slowly in my closet because they're, they're huge. But um, whatever. I would love to paint in here, but it's carpeted. Though I don't really care about these rugs. I have other rugs that I could put down, and I have a bunch of, like, drop cloth. So that's always an option to paint in here. It doesn't have great light, though. And some of the painting that I do, though I could put something in the ceiling, is, uh, like, a pendulum painting. And I currently use the fan in my kitchen to do that so I would have to put some hole and or hook in the ceiling which might be fully worth it I'm kind of thinking that I want to do some sort of art here I was planning on like painting this wall green but I actually just put rollers on this desk so that I can move it more because I found that when I teach yoga in this room virtually like it's just a better angle if I do it like at a 45 degree so if I go in the corner I get this other corner so I don't know if it would be helpful to have just that one wall green and I don't want a fucking green room the other wall is just floor to ceiling mirrors so it would just be a lot also, it would be, like, reflecting back onto me, and so kind of, like, pointless as far as actually, um, I, it, it would be better if I did a blue screen, but I think we might do a basic tape geometric mural, but I've never done that before, so I was thinking I might just start playing around with putting tape on the wall and seeing if I like it. We'll see about that. Those are some updates from my brain. You know, this is this is my life. Um, I'm really glad that my computer, which, God, it's just, it makes me so annoyed how expensive technology is. I'm likely still going to have to get a better 
camera because currently I'm using my iPhone as a webcam, which is great, but it's also nice to be able to have the phone whilst live streaming. Also, I generally am like recording things while I'm making art. Um, but the plan here is to create more regular um, online yoga. I don't know if it's classes. I don't know if it's workshops or like a series um, or if it's just kind of like free and joining when you want to or not. Um, and then I just want to paint. I just, and I, I always find that when I like set a schedule with other people that it holds me account accountable. Um, I don't know if people are going to enjoy just like watching me paint, but I find it fun. So we'll see. It's slow. So it might be interesting, might not be. And we'll, we're going to have to figure out a, a Philip cam. So, you know, things to figure out. Who knew? Yeah, I guess I can't see the comments on Twitter. Or none of you are leaving any, which is also totally fine. Um, if anyone is on Twitter and can comment have to figure out a, a on this, like within the live, if you tap the live and then you like write a comment because you can like leave hearts. It's weird how we got rid of Periscope and then like it still exists just on Twitter. I don't understand. Um, but I can't see it on the computer. This is really fun for, for the five people watching. Thank you. Thank you. Really appreciate you. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm just going to chill here more. I just applied to be able to go live on TikTok on the computer. I didn't realize it was like a separate application, which is kind of dumb. We'll see. They said they would let me know in a day, so that's, that's a quick turnaround. We'll find out. Um, but it just makes me so happy that, like, I haven't had any frame drops, as far as I see. Um, and it's only using, like, 1% of my CPU to stream to two locations. We love that. We love to see that. I'm going to check my RAM and see how that's doing. I mean, a third. I only have 32 gigabytes of RAM, but I can upgrade to 64. I just have to then like purchase 32 and 32. DDMR5s or whatever those are. <laughs> and those are like $200. So I don't want to add that additional expense if I don't have to. And it appears that I do not. So that's really great. We'd love to see that. Hi, hi. Read only chat, stream chat. I'm going to have to figure out this vertical slash horizontal situation because I'm, I'm like multi-streaming right now on Twitch and on Twitter and Twitch is horizontal, but Twitter is vertical. And yeah, if anyone has any graphic designers that they love that do animation, um, I have a friend that I'm talking to 
for like some overlays and maybe some emotes, but I don't remember if they do animation. So uh, things to figure out. Of course, like, you know, I do and I do graphic design or like I've been doing that since, you know, a wee lad, but um, I don't really like doing it. I'd rather pay someone. It's just, it's, it's so time consuming and I get too perfectionist about it. Also, like, I don't want to make decisions. I just want somebody else to make like the final decision. It's always so much easier to design for someone else because it's like, I don't know, the stakes are just like a lot lower. So I'm just trying to get away from that. And this whole like live journey is just because I, I spend so much time filming things that I do and then I get in a rut of like not wanting to edit them together so I just like would rather do it live and then maybe have someone edit it after the fact I don't know I'm gonna try recording and see if that you know uses so much more CPU um I mean, it's not. This is crazy to me that it's just like 1.1. I mean, I only have one input or two inputs. I should try. I should try adding a video capture. So you have a little video capture card. I need to figure out how I would watch it because this screen is kind of old. But um, let's see, how much RAM is that using now? Still only 30%. The only thing I need to figure out with this computer is memory because it only has, or not memory, storage. It only has one gigabyte. I think it can have like there's like a solid state and a spinning, but it doesn't have a spinning installed. So I could install one. I kind of just want to have like, like a monthly SSD, like a one. Oh, it's not gigabyte. It's terabyte. It's a one terabyte. Um, I, feel as though like if I get a new one every month and I just like have a little bit more cataloged information rather than like getting a really giant one that just lives forever and then like crashes like you know soon because I'm really great at putting so many files on a computer that it overwhelms the operating system or gets completely full like my MacBook Pro from 2014 has like five, 10 gigabytes left from being completely full. And I will say that it's now fully backed up because I just upgraded to the six terabyte um, the Apple storage iCloud. That was the word I was looking for. Um, I didn't want to, but 30 bucks a month. The thing with that is though, like I'd rather just have it all in one place and it's all on the cloud at this point. Plus when I had the two terabyte, it used to be 20, the two terabyte iCloud storage, it used to be $20 a month. And then like a couple years ago, it went down to 10. So I would imagine they'll do the same as they continue to expand you know, the data library that is Apple. But thank God they finally made it larger. Because I was full. Like, I was, I have like three terabytes worth of photos of docs on my, um, on my iCloud drive. Um, okay, well, this has been really great. I think I might just 
end this now, and I'll probably be back later today to test playing like Mario Party or something, or Mario Kart. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but thank you for watching. I love y'all. I appreciate you. Um, and you know, if it's your first time seeing me, <laughs> feel free to follow. <laughs> okay, bye.